Hello and welcome back to another video and on this video um, I'd, I'm adding, uh, excuse me, another fighter to my modern database and this fighter is rising light heavyweight champion, um, Dimitri Bivol. Um, so we will look at Dimitri Bivol's career, he's not had a large career, this is a very short video compared to some others, um, but Bivol's stats and numbers will be upgraded in the database from each fight forward. So Dimitri Bivol. In his short career of 14 and 0 with 11 KOs, um, has won all his fights, so he's 14 and 0 with 11 KOs. Now, he has beaten two former top 10 rated fighters that is, top 10 rated Sullivan Barrera, um, and more recently, he beat top 10 rated Isaac Chilemba. So that pretty much is it so far. Bivol is a young fighter in number of fights. Not necessarily in age, but in number of fights, he's a young fighter, um, so he hasn't done too much work. He's not yet fought a world champion, Dimitri Bivol, um, but he is now two win, no loss, no draw against top 10 rated fighters, and he's yet to fight a top three rated fighter or a ring champion. So Dimitri Bivol um, can go forward and build his resume as he goes, and it's going to be fascinating to see what fights he can get. He's willing to fight Elidia Alvarez in December, I believe he said. Um, so, you know, there's potential for many, many more big fights and many names being added to Bivol's roster. So when we look at his stats, Dimitri Bivol, of course, has beaten no world champions and thus has no rounds against champions. In world title fights, okay, um, he has three wins, no loss, no draw. In world title fights, does Bivol. Um, he scored two KOs or stoppages in those three straight title fight wins. And of course, being upgraded to champion, he has made three defences of his title. Dimitri Bivol has fought 25 title fight rounds in his career to date. Um, and in the two stats at the bottom, fights against rated fighters or champions. Dimitri Bivol, of course, has fought two. Um, and Dimitri Bivol has won two. So unlike other fighters like Inui and Lomachenko, Bivol's career at the moment in a short number of fights is not that strong. Um, but like all careers, some are different. Some start out quick, some start out slower. <coughs> the end result is what matters more than anything. The end result is what matters. So Bivol has scored 11 KOs or stoppages um, in his career today. Uh, and Bivol has also scored two KOs or stoppages inside three rounds. And has also scored one first round KO of course, that we saw recently. Uh, Dimitri Bivol has not obviously beaten any world champion, so he's no chaos or stoppages um, against world champions. And Dimitri Bivol, um, from his three title fight wins, as I explained on last slide, has got two KOs in title fights. So there is the basic career, first stat slide and KO stats for Dimitri Bivol. Um, we'll close out his video um, and go on to his title accomplishments. This is a short video because like I say, all fighters have careers of different types. Bivol can grow as he goes. So Bivol is of course a one weight world champion at the moment. Uh, who knows, after f campaigning at light heavyweight, he may end up at cruiser at some point. But at the moment he's a one weight world champion and the title Dimitri Bivol holds is the WBA light heavyweight title. But there is potential there for lots of big fights, unification fights with Stevenson, um, you know, um, Elidia Alvarez, etc. Potential for lots more big fights in which Dimitri Bivol can build his roster even further. But there's Bivol's video. I'm out.